Are you having one of those days where hair keeps getting in the way? Eyebrows just don't want to look flawless. And on top of that, your sister is getting on your last nerve. Gather around, get your tea ready, and relax. DIY will fix all of your problems. Here is your cup, miss. Let's just fix up that lipstick real quick. Oh dear, but the hand mirror is all shattered. Don't worry, love. They say glass pieces bring good luck. How about that cup? Yeah, you know what I mean. Just put a bit of lipstick on the top side of the cup in the shape of your bottom lip. You think that's silly? Prepare to be surprised. Just press it against your lips and rub them together. Voila! Gorgeous red. Clever and so simple. And here comes Lucas. The boy simply can't stop himself from complimenting you. Just keep our technique a secret, okay? Ah! Oh wait, silly me. That's just Emily. What was that? Are you serious? What is this mess? Emily! Get your ass off the couch and clean this all up. Sisters, am I right? <laughs> This cannot continue. Let's try making a reusable mask instead. Grab a scarf and cut it in the shape of a face mask. Add one tablespoon of green tea, half a tablespoon of liquid honey, and about one fourth tablespoon of argan oil. Just a few drops of lemon juice and mix it all up. Once you are done, simply dip that sheet you made into the mixture. And it's good to use. Hey sis, try this. I'm not doing it. Come on, just try it. Okay, let's take a look. Oh, this doesn't look too bad. And it feels amazing. Way to go, sis. And no more mess. The best part is that you can use it multiple times. Just wash it and let it dry. I can't believe we cut our hair short and it still manages to get in the way. Where is that hairband when you need it? Just calm down. Breathe in, breathe out, zen. Oh, you are kidding me. Ugh. Oh my gosh, pantyhose. Here is an idea. Braid two pairs of pantyhose together. Cut off both the top and the bottom. Glue on some pins to accessorize it. And lastly, glue both ends together. That's it! Now we have an awesome hairband to hold our hair back during makeup sessions. Not a hair out of place and no more stress on your beautiful face. What fun lip look are we going with today? Hmm, perhaps classic red? But we are just not feeling it today. Perhaps we should be bold and make them white. Nah, that's a bit too plain. What about using both of them together? Yep, that sounds like a plan. First, separate both sides with a red lip pencil and color one whole side of your lips. Then, fill in the other side with a different color. Rub your lips together and blend it all with a brush. Apply some clear lip balm on top and we are done. You can mix and match all sorts of different colors for different occasions. Mwah! Hello there, sweetheart. Nice to see you again. Wow, those lips look amazing. Why, thank you, Joshua. We did our best. It looks like that gradient lip hack was a success. Our girls here are having a makeup session. It just seems like somehow Caroline keeps failing at it miserably. And here comes Emma, a girl that knows eyebrow problems far too well. Just take a pair of tweezers and use them as guidelines. I get it. About time.
just take tweezers and some eyebrow pomade. Dip them in and create those guidelines. Then simply fill in the brows and we are done. Wasn't that simple? No need for experience at all. Thanks girl, this is awesome. Looky, the girls are here. Let's get to that coffee and gossip ASAP. Mmm. So much to talk about and time flies faster than an eagle on steroids. After a few hours of spilling the tea, the girls are getting ready to leave. Okay, time to clean this up. So many coffee grounds to wash out. Or maybe not. Let's take those coffee grounds and add six tablespoons to a bowl. Then add two tablespoons of coconut oil. Mix it all up and fill your ice tray with the mixture. You can choose your tray to have some fun shapes. We'll show you why this will make it more fun. Now, simply freeze it and that's it. Here we have a diamond shape. Doesn't it look cool? And making it was definitely not as expensive. The next day, the girls are back for some more juicy gossip. And Jessica brings a little surprise. No, 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 it's not for eating. Look, you rub it on your skin. Wow, so smooth. And it smells just like coffee. This is so cool. It looks like the girls love it. Sugar, spice, and everything nice. All these ingredients plus Chemical X were chosen to create the perfect thumbs up. So don't forget to smash that like button, Crafty Pandas. Subscribe to our channel and leave a comment down below. Looking for some inspiration for your next hairdo, Emily? Do you already know what you want to try? Set your phone up and let's get started. Three, two, one. Achoo! Wow, our violet mermaid turned into a fiery lioness. That is definitely something. Would you mind showing us how it's done? Well, you need to take a strand of hair from the top of your head and braid some extensions into it. Do about three inches, secure with a transparent rubber band, and add more extensions. Repeat repeat, and repeat. Use different colors too. Once you do the French braids all the way to the back of your hair, make one smaller braid and wrap it around the base. Make multiple such braids. Secure them with rubber bands and pull them upwards to tease your hair into small puffs. Do all of your hair like that or until you are happy with the result. We're not saying that this is a fast look or that you would be able to do it on your own, but should you fancy a definite head turner done with only the most basic of hairdressing skills, then, well, let the visuals speak for themselves. Emily, you look absolutely electrifying. Ah, oh, rainbow. Ah, silver. And ah, uh, nothing. Let's look around. Okay, so this looks like an eyeshadow palette and brushes. We know these, right? It can't be that difficult. Let's do this. Just be careful. Blah, that's a big no, no, no. Could we use anything else? Like this bottle cap. Um, what could we possibly use it for? How about using it as an outline for eyeshadow? This already looks so much better. Now just take a lighter color and apply it on the rest of the eyelid. See, even we can create something beautiful with a simple bottle cap. Oh, but that smile is the real touch of beauty. Hey, look at me guys. Yup. You have really outdone yourself, girl. 
sorry, girl, for taking so long. I just saw the cutest puppy ever, and it was just so adorable. I just can't even. <laughs> Are you even listening? <laughs> Take a look. <laughs> Holy fudge muffin! Better run before Madison falls off the chair from laughter! Okay, let's do something about those brows. First, the power of transition. And now, take an eyebrow pencil and some gentle floss, so that the eyebrows won't be rough on the edges. Take one long string of floss, color part of it using an eyebrow pencil, and use it to mark the guidelines like this. Now, simply fill in your eyebrows. Let's erase those lines. We don't want anyone to know our secret now, do we? Symmetry at its finest. Brow-tastic! I'm back! Now, what do you think? Oh, now we're talking. They look awesome! I know, right? Take a pic! I'm sure there won't be any more raised brows looking at hers. Hey, gorgeous pandas, I hope you enjoyed these beauty hacks. Let us know which of them you're going to use next in the comments down below. If you want to learn more, feel free to check out our older videos. Hit the subscribe button and ring that bell to stay tuned for more.